Ladies and gentlemen. Good evening, everybody. Joe Tessitore alongside Teddy Atlas, and welcome to the Aragon Ballroom here in Chicago, Illinois, for tonight's main event. Ten rounds of heavyweight action. A lot of talk heading into tonight's matchup. Everybody expecting this to be a great night of action. All right, gentlemen, protect yourselves at all times. Let's touch them up. Opening round scheduled for 10. Teddy, I understand some of the obstacles that this counterpuncher faces from an offensive standpoint of what he wants to try to do against this outside fighter. What about defense? What does he to be conscious of defense? Well, he can't fall asleep, first of all. And, you know, some of that is consistent with what he has to do no matter who he's fighting. Counter punches are usually pretty good defensively. I mean, that's how they create their offense, Joe. They make you miss. So, you know, he's got to make sure he stays on his P's and Q's. That, you know, when he's walking after the guy, he's going to have to go after him a little bit. That, you know, he's ready for the guy to stop a pot shot. You know, it's not like when the guy's coming at him and he's ready all the time. He's got to make sure that he's ready in different situations. A little head hunting never hurt. Does it with the hook. Devastating blow by Simons. Able to dismiss his opponent's shot and then comes back with an uppercut. And coming upon the halfway mark of this three-minute round, he missed by a mile. That wasn't even close by Simmons. Solid shot again downstairs. Defense easily turns into offense. Blocks a blow, sends an uppercut. Simmons coming up big here early on in the fight because he just showed his opponent, hey, listen, you got to be careful. I can counterpunch you. No better way to slow down your opponent. You know, we know the other way you slow him down. You hit him right on the chin and you make him say, hey, I don't want to walk in. But when you make him miss and you counter, that slows him down too. Last 10 seconds. End of the round. And his lack of defense caught up with him there. No doubt about it. I mean, he just keeps his hands low. Yeah, he keeps his hands low. He doesn't move his head enough. He's an inviting target. He's a guy that you want if you're in the other corner. Yeah. Here we go. Round two is underway. Gives one, the right hand scores well. Good work with the uppercuts. Nice job there. What a big shot. He is down on the floor after taking that shot. And there's a lot of time left in the round. continue on here and if he's gonna stay in this fight now he's got to avoid this opponent like the black plague oh good defense there that was a fine block by Simmons Simmons doing a really good job of being defensively sound, of being patient, and waiting for that golden opportunity for some offense to come in the mix. Well, that's exactly what he's doing. He's waiting for a mistake to be made. You know, he wants a lead out of his opponent right now so he can make a miss and bang, come right back with that hook. Solid hook upstairs. Get the, get the another jab 
Smart punch right there. The uppercut worked. shots that aren't sharp or targeted. That has been his problem tonight. Ten seconds to go in this round. Good combination. End of the round there. A round in which we did see the knockdown and Teddy when a fighter comes back to the corner having just been floored. Typically, how are they acting? What are you seeing out of them? Just imagine you just walked into a room and somebody hit you from behind. You dropped. You're afraid to go in that room again. So, put a light on in that room and explain to him why he got dropped. He will not be afraid to go back in that room. Good way to finish the left hook to the head with the uppercut. Tucks those elbows in, blocks the body shot. Simmons is keeping... He's guard up very, very well. Teddy, does it help to have the speed that he has? Uh, sure. Anytime you have speed and you can put it into the equation where whatever you're doing, it has to be technically right, but now you put speed, you're doing it even better. You're doing it at a higher level. Keep your hands up. A little defense turns into offense. He blocks the shot, comes right back with one of his own. Coming to the halfway point of this third round. Oh! One punch power has ended this fight. Can you believe that? There is no way he could continue on. It is done. Wow, the theater of the unexpected. Who would have ever expected that? Simmons, one single lightning bolt of a punch ends this night early. And it came right out of the skies, and it came right in the position where his opponent never saw it. For Teddy Atlas, I'm Joe Tessitore. That does it ringside. We'll see you soon.